I did some digging and I can do a side-by-side -side comparison. Someone commented on Sarah's TikTok page stating, remember when she posted a video talking about Iran and pointed to a pic of Iran in the 80s and said, wow, they were just like us in reference to Julia's TikToks. Sarah responded with, yep, that was my video she copied. Glad you remembered. Wait. Want to know what happened? Religious extremism. Yeah, that happened. And it's happening in America. And just a reminder, Sarah's accusing Julia of copying her videos verbatim. And I have believed to have found Sarah's video where she's talking about the same subject. It used to be a westernized society that turned into a militant and extremist society. It's exactly like Handmaid's Tale. And now we're seeing actual footage of what the residents are posting, even though their internet is out. They're getting this to us somehow. Everyone needs to be aware and against this type of extremism, and we need to rise together. And, and this is what I think is going on, and no hate to this creator. This creator has not made the statement or made any assumptions of this. This is only my opinion, so no hate on this creator. I can't emphasize that enough. So three days ago, this creator made a video about past lives and basically, you know, people get reincarnated into toddlers. On the same day is when she made the video accusing Julia of stealing her content. On the same day, I can't tell you if it was posted before or after Sarah's video, but that doesn't really matter. Six months after Julia's best friend passed away, she found out she was pregnant and when she calculated her son's due date, it was the same as her best friend's birthday. And she mentioned how she had a dream about her best friend asking to be reincarnated into her baby. Julia also mentions that behind her is a portrait of her son and her best friend and how her son looks at that portrait and points to it all the time. I think that would be a really crappy reason to accuse someone of stealing your content. Julia does not reference the same article about the reincarnation like Sarah did in her TikTok. At most, I could see Julia coming up across this TikTok and being like, oh my gosh, like I can relate to this. I will make a video. And I think it would be a really crappy reason to bring drama to Julia's story and being vulnerable and opening up about a hard time in her life. And that's my two cents. Let me know what you guys think.